Here's one from Benny. He asks, what's the best way to keep a preventive maintenance uh, as it regards to dust? How can we keep all this dust out of our computer? And the simple answer is not to be where dust might be. Keep the dust away from you, and it won't get in your computer. That's a pretty ridiculous answer because there's dust everywhere. But the challenge we have as technology professionals that need to fix this is how you resolve it. Um, there is a, a, a section out uh, that I visit very often on Reddit that is almost the technicians are almost always dealing with dust problems. And that's one of those things when you get into dealing with, uh, with tech-type problems, uh, especially if you go to reddit.com, it is in the tech support Reddit. Uh, it's the slash r slash tech support that has a lot of these with pictures. And you can see this caked on dust on these people's machines. It is a mess. And to get it off, they're taking apart all the heat sinks, all the fans. They're cleaning them out. So to the point that Benny asked, can we just avoid that completely? Well, you sort of can. Uh, you generally don't put filters on a computer fan. I have seen those before and for environments, especially in environments that just have a lot of dirt, manufacturing facilities, printing areas. If you're in a printing press, a printing house, there's just paper dust all over the place. So it's very common to do something like that. So uh, there may be an option to do something like a filter. If it's in a house, keep it off the floor. If it's in a, a building, uh, keep it away from the floor because people are putting their feet down. They're banging up the dust. It's being pulled in with the fan. If you can keep it on top of the table, you can keep it away from the dust. You really will be that much better. And ultimately, the, one of the very common preventive maintenance things is to just pull the top off every year or so and get a, a vacuum that's designed to work with low static so that you can vacuum out pieces of it. Or if you have compressed air, and, and I highly recommend not using the cans, but using a compressor of compressed air just from a, a environmental perspective, a green perspective, and, and just use the compressed air to blow out some of that. Maybe not the full-blown compressed air. Very lightly. Make sure you don't damage anything inside of that. Um, there's a great... A video on the internet that Kerry Holtzman did where he took the machine outside and turned on the leaf blower. Probably not the best recommendation, but a fantastic video to watch somebody leaf blowing out a computer that will absolutely clean the dust out. I'm not quite certain how well it's going to work after you put everything back together. However, those are just some of the ways you can use to try to make sure that you keep the dust out of your computer. And once it gets in, some of the easy ways to clean it out.